Good morning, everybody. It's 647 as we start with live Doppler radar. A couple of sprinkles across Allegan County uh, up here in uh, northern portions of Nuego County. We'll see a few showers kind of rotate into the area. Lake effect, lake enhanced instability showers once the sun comes out. I don't think we're going to see much of the sun because there's going to be more cloud cover today than there was yesterday and maybe a few passing showers. It's 40 degrees right now in Soresco, uh, 43 in Marshall, 42 on the north side of Kalamazoo, 44 in Hickory Corners, Middleville is 43 degrees. We have 43 in Clarksville, 43 in Belding, Fremont is in the mid 40s and 43 degrees, a popular number there in uh, Big Rapids as well. Our forecast for today calling for mostly cloudy skies. A chance of a few isolated to scattered showers today. It's not going to rain all day. Some of us may miss out on it, uh, but high temperatures only around 50 degrees with the west wind at about 5 to 15 miles per hour. Here's what it looks like on future track at 9 o'clock. Look at all the cloud cover here. And again, a few showers, especially along and north of I-96 would be the best chance. That doesn't mean that you folks across our southern counties can't see them, but there's a better chance of those showers along and north of I-96. Even as we go through the evening and the overnight hours, uh, eventually, this upper level low pressure system will start to pull away and will decrease the cloud cover and see a little bit more sunshine on Wednesday. But that, too, is short lived. As we go uh, Wednesday night into Thursday, you can see some showers across our southern counties will be possible. And then as we go into Thursday, we'll pull out to a wider perspective. This low pressure system and warm front are going to move our way. And there's a lot of moisture with this. This is as far out as this forecast model goes to 6 p.m. on Thursday. I'll pick up the track of this in our super seven day forecast here in just a second. So let's go through it. 50 degrees today, some isolated scattered showers possible. Tomorrow we've got 57 degrees, partly cloudy to partly sunny skies. And then on Thursday, mostly cloudy skies with some scattered showers, especially across our southern counties with temperatures in the mid 50s. Let's pull this out and take a look at what we're talking about here. We'll pick this up Thursday at 6 p.m. This is the European forecast model and this is the track of the low. Watch what happens as we go through Thursday night into Friday. Some showers are going to be possible, but they become steadier to moderate as we get into Friday night uh, and into Saturday. This is Saturday morning at 6 a.m. Another low pressure system is right overhead. Uh, rain showers throughout a good portion of that time frame. That'll hold our temperatures down into the 40s to around the 50 degree mark. And then Sunday, that will be lifting out of here. So if that sounds like a lot of rain, indeed it is. Uh, that's reflected in our super seven day forecast. 55 degrees p.m. and nighttime rain there on Friday. Rain uh, like off and on all day on Saturday, a few lingering showers on Sunday. And if we look at the forecast model, the European model, about how much rainfall we'll see during that time frame, there's a good slug of moisture coming in here all the way into Sunday at 6 p.m. We think probably at least an inch or two. Some places may see two to three inches of rain. So it's going to be a good soaking, especially as we get into the second part of uh, Friday night and then going through the day on Saturday as well. So I know that's probably not what everybody wants to hear but that's where we're going here over the next uh, several days. Uh, that is a look at our forecast, guys. It's 6.50. All right. Kevin, thank you.